I wasted 3-4 hours yesterday trying to build this, unsuccessfully. But now this feature is on master, and it builds fine. Which obviously sucks, because it could have been my first Plasma WIP video, but whatever, next time. So, before we had that ugly icon on top right, that was giving us some options to edit stuff on Plasma Desktop. That's now gone! And now, my amazing KDE build skills in action! So, this icon is finally gone with God blessings, and we now have three ways to open Plasma Edit Mode. First, we can use the context menu as before. Second we can use a D-Bus property, binding on a shortcut or inside settings. But fuck those two, because there's a third option that is really cool. We can long press on desktop, and edit mode is magically opening. So now we have this top bar with a few options. We can open widget sidebar, and drop unknown stuff on our desktop, that are doing unknown things. Then we can open Activities, which is one of the things that Plasma should merge with virtual desktops, but anyway. Then Configure Desktop opens Background Actions, but outside the rest settings, that is something awful. Last but not least, that also opens Bottom Panel Editing Mode. Basically the best part of this, is a long press on Desktop to activate it, which also applies on widgets. So, if we exit the Edit Mode, we can still long press on a widget and get into widget edit mode. Pretty pretty cool mechanisms, and this is a nice consistency on design. Oh, and meanwhile, I don't know if it is true, but I heard that KDE developers went out the night. <laughs>